unholy alliance is forged within the depths of Othrenbroth. The Great Barrow, a sinister pact which could spell doom for Eriador. Come now, my hearties. Between those stones is what you look for, the Great Barrow of the Downs. Careful now, or you will be bones will lie until the whites have you a dancing. Uh huh. Well, he's dancing on his own, I guess. Well then, with the way he dances, maybe we should introduce Marigold's sister to this area. Uh, which sister was it? Just so many siblings, I can't keep them straight anymore. Not that I was ever able to keep them straight at all. Come, Scorgrim! Oh! Scorgrim? Isn't that that dwarf we met earlier? Alright, there you go. Let us head inside into the Great Barrow. Well, this looks like a nice merry place, doesn't it? Hmm. Ah, uh, hello! Look a little dead, don't you? Well then, let's see what we could find regarding dour hands, I guess. Who goes there? Uh, just a hobbit. Nothing to worry about. See? Come, boys. Let's cleave them in twain. Well, just try it. Just try it, I say. Let's head back down, down, into White Town, into Barrow Town, Barrow White Town. At least this is going to work on my. Well, actually, this section won't work on my white deed because this is a bunch of dower hands. There aren't any deeds in this area for dower hands. This is one of the few places you run into dower hands. You only run into dower hands as far as I know in Reland. The only ones I know of are the ones that are part of instances, that are part of the storyline. Right, because in, in the Shire you have that small section to it. In Breeland, I can't think of any. You ain't taking me down! You, you want to bet? Now, what were you saying? Oh, I'm sorry, you're too dead to answer? Because you were taken down, that's why. <laughs> knock, knock. Hi there. Want to die? You heard, Lord Scorgrim! No one gets past us! Uh, are you sure about that? Hello? Yeah, I'd appreciate it if you start the battle. Alright! You've killed my men, but you won't kill me! Are you sure? I can't be defeated! Yeah, well... Stay back! Scorgrim promised. He said we shall not be defeated. What? What was that noise? Uh, I think you're defeated. Right? Does dead suffer no intruders? Well, I suffer no dead. There you go. Well, this would certainly work on my dead slayer deed. I wonder how I'm doing on that now. White Slayer advanced. 16, 17. Maybe even 18 now. I, th I think those arms are worth something. No. They just give you a hand. Uh, where were we? Oh, hello. You're a deadly Barrow White. Well, okay, just take away the L-Y and it'll be a perfect description for you, right? There you go. Open sesame! Oh, hello! Maybe I shouldn't have been so anxious there. Oh, we'll take care of you first. Then we'll take care of your friend. Page 15 added to the Journal of Cardolan. 
Well, that'd be good because that's one of those exploration deeds I still need to complete. And soon. Wait. Maybe I better eat something before I continue on in this. Because we don't want to. I know it's not that tough of a dungeon at my. Well, on level, it's not that tough of a dungeon. Uh, let's see. But you don't want to have your morale to go down and you say, Oh, I wasn't paying attention to it. Oops. I guess there are deadly tomb whites because they are siggies instead of normals. Oh, the Witch King. Our plans in the south are reaching fruition. The ring moves east to Imladras, no doubt. Once your tasks are complete, Mordrith awaits you both in the north. My champion has not yet finished her task. Our plans in the south. Oh, okay. I, I think that means it's time for me to come down before he turns into a skipping record. Fools, I shall not suffer you any longer. You have hounded my steps for too long. And now the dead shall take you. Ha <laughs> ha! Right. Yeah? And in what way will they take me? All you do is add to my number of... Oh, page 22. Deed completed. Lore of the Carlin Prince. Okay, that's good. That's with this he that means that we've got Explore a Breland. All I have to do is to explore the barrel downs and I'll be finished with that deed. That shouldn't take too much more. I probably have a couple places I need to explore in the southern barrel downs to finish that up. I think I got all the highlights in the northern barrel downs, but who knows? Oh Sammy! Hello Greetings full if thou seekest an audience, thou mayest approach. I'm sorry, I have to put in the proper grammar there. Well met. My master sends thee greetings. I grant thee the boon of an audience before I kill thee. Thou seemest desirous of certain knowledge, so I will givest it to thee. Well, okay, I, I blew that one. For the dead speak not. <laughs> My master seeks a great power for the Dark Lord. But the Dark Lord has more designs than this, yes. The Pale Dwarf shall go to the north and gather an army in the name of Ungmar and the Witch King. The Gaunt One, a great power himself and to whom I owe this form goes to the east. There, Agamar, he shall awaken a power that lies sleeping in the waters. With her under his command, the skies will turn to blood, and all shall despair. <laughs> now thine audience has come to an end. Thy death awaits thee. Arise, my warriors! All right, fine. Fall, his warriors! Your your warriors weren't per particularly useful, were they? That's what I say. Thou cannot defeat me. Are you sure about that? Thou cannot defeat me. Do I have a? F what? 
It cannot be! Oh, hello, Tom. What? Yeah, uh... What were you thinking? Dead man should not be walking. Vanish into sunlight. Leave your barrels empty. Uh, thank you. Was it worth the trouble? Did you learn your lesson? Leave the dead to sleep their dreams. Sleep then walk yourself upon the green grass under the sun. Come now, my merry friends. Warm fire is awaiting. Right. Warm fire is awaiting. That's done. He do merry do, my hearty. The darkness is behind us and that dank and dreary tomb. We'll make our way back into the light and feel the sun on our faces once more. And you get a reward. Let's see what's in store. Well, I suppose this is, <laughs> that's right, when light armor gives you a perfect upgrade to your medium armor. Yeah, well, that shows you something great. What can I do for you today? Well, old Barrow Whites from Ankmar came. They disturb the peace and trouble folk which wander through their mouths. Let the dead sleep and leave their troubles in the earth. Unless, of course, you wake them, dancing on their rooftops. Hey, come, my friends, linger here no longer. To Bree, you should be a going. Your friend there who awaits you. All right, fine. Back to Strider, then. Let's go and see what he has to say. And, of course, we have all these quests from these tombs in the Barrel Downs that we must also turn in. And before I go and see Strider, though, I... Probably should check out this chest here, which I was told to examine. And I collected the ancient journal. And I should bring this to Tobo Leaf Cutter, and then we'll be able to handle him. But I think I'm going to go into another one of these things. Because I have a one more of those little runes, or whatever those are called ancient texts that I need to make a rubbing of. Uh, and there is one right there. How oh, perfect! I mean, I'll be able to hand that in. Speak with Strider. And do all sorts of things. Hmm. Well, that's a pretty small tomb. Does this text help any? Hello there. Ah, you found something! Many of the pages are missing, but perhaps I can make something of it. Hmm. This is almost too terrible to read. The author, a man of Cardolan, tells how those few of Cardolan who remain died in a great plague, borne along by dark clouds from the east. Soon after, fell spirits swept down from the north. The man writes of tormenting dreams that followed, dreams of a place called Angmar. Soon after, the dead walked the land once more. In the last entry, the man writes that he fears that he too will succumb to the plague, but that his body will never know rest. How I wish I had remained ignorant of these cursed lands! Yet now I find I must know more. If you ever find more pages of this journal, bring them to me. Perhaps in this knowledge, a defense against these fell spirits can be learned. Hey, I did collect all these pages from the Cardlin prints. I wonder if any of them have anything to do with it. Let's see. Hmm. E oh well. I'll just take the shield then. Will you give me a moment of your time, friend? Now, unfortunately, the last one is for an instance. So uh, I am not. I have it here just in case I run the Great Barrow with someone, but I am not going to put any odds on that. So instead, I think it's time for us to head back to Bree. Hopefully Strider will find this information of use and... Locked. Well then, maybe he's not going to find it of use. Well, maybe he stepped out for a moment. Who knows? 
Uh, hello there. Have you seen Strider around? How can I be of service? Oh, sorry, I was so busy I didn't see you. But there's never a moment's peace here, if I say so. I was so worried about he sour the beer for letting Mr. <clears throat> uh, Underhill and his friends go off with that ranger. He who? Oh, why, that would be Mr. Gandalf, of course. He says that he's a wizard of or such, and I'll say there must be something to those tales, for my beer's never been better. He, he was so pleased, yes. Oh, oh, begging your pardon, but I do run on sometimes. Gandalf said to send anyone looking for Strider up to his room. It's up the stairs just beyond Strider's room. Uh, uh, fine. All right. A wizard. Boy, this is going to create some interesting stuff. Uh, hello there. Uh, Gandalf? Well, yeah, you look like you could be a wizard. Why do you disturb me? It's a long story. You are lost or seek me with intent? By the look of your eye, I gather the latter, though I also sense you sought another. Strider, perhaps? Then we have both come too late. Our mutual friend has left, bearing with him a terrible burden. I am Gandalf the Grey, a friend of Strider's. If he set you on to a task, it could not be much less urgent than his own. Hmm. Tell me your tale, and I will deliver it to him. Oh, so Angmar arises. It is grim news, but I'm not surprised. Nevertheless, I cannot turn aside from my own task, for the fate of all Middle-earth hangs upon it. This burden I place upon you in the name of the free peoples of Middle-earth. Hinder the Witch-King's plans, if you may. Whether east or north, I bid you good fortune. Farewell! Wonderful. Simply wonderful. I need your assistance. You have done much good for the people of Breeland, but the shadow out of Angmar spreads far and wide. I have learned from Gwaihir the Windlord that another of my order has found corruption in the Lone Lands, east of Bree. It may even be related to the dangers you encounter by the Great Barrow. He did something, say something about the Lone Lands. Yes. Well, unfortunately, Radagast is given to wandering and it will be difficult to find. I would ask that you enlist the assistance of the rangers in finding his location. There is one here in Breland, Saradin, who will be able to help you. Head, yes, yes, I've spoken to Saradin already. Well, good. Then head out and find him and perhaps he'll help you find Radagast. Uh, we'll have to find if that's true. While I was in the Barrel Downs, I managed to get a Traveler Steelbound loot box, my first for this character. And I thought that maybe every once in a while I could open up one of these. So, at what intervals I'll do it, I haven't decided yet. But let's try see what a minimal loot box will give you. Probably nothing useful, that's for sure. Yeah, let's go. Now, I received four items. I mean, four keys in for my character when I created my character. So that's what these things are all about. Let's see, I got reinforced swift padded brutes of the wayfarer, level 19 boots, 14 agility, 13 vitality, 105. Parry rating, it's not too bad. Actually, that's a pretty sweet set of boots there. Worth 70 motes when I'm done with it. Well, that's going to be hard to remember that anything's going to be worth motes of enchantment because so, many, so few things at low levels are worth such things. Let's see. So, and 240 motes of enchantment. How many does that give me now? 840. I need a thousand before I could exchange them for figments and get some stuff with it. So, nice if I could get some fit. Tome of the Banded Snake. Well. There you go. One Banded Snake. That's a uh, interesting. Okay, a pet. A pet snake. Alright. Universal Ingredients Packs. Okay, that most of enchantment and fear. So actually, that's not too bad of a 
haul from there. I was expecting a lot worse, I have to tell you, but a decent set of boots. And of course, the set of boots you get is probably going to just level with you. So if I were, so maybe when I had 10 levels or so, I could work on something else. Let's see. I've managed to what turn can I do for you? There you go. I've turned in that rep stuff for the intro quest there. That should give me some nice reputation. How's my reputation doing with Bree? Ooh, man of Bree. I'm at friend right now at 14,000. Okay. What's your need? Say, okay, I got the ancient tags. What can I do for you? Some shards. And I also killed one How of the stalkers. Good. And that's a daily quest, so I might do a couple of those in the in interval or something like that. But that concludes today's episode. And when we return next time, it is time for us to head back to Bingo Boffin. Yes, back to Bingo. Go with him into the barrel downs, and then if we have extra time, then perhaps head into the southern barrel downs. But that's when we return for the next episode of The Complete Pine Leaf.